All right, just a better shot with the parking here at 2069 Dutton Mill Road. And there you go. Best shot there. Now we're going to jump out front. All right, 2069 Dutton Mill Road here in Newtown Square. A KW listing, Maggie's. So right here in Dutton Mill Road. Obviously, they added on to this one. I would presume, presume and really cool. Because I'll just keep the outside, then we'll head inside and show you. But you do have a big three-car garage in the back. A lot of exit points here. A big deck, and you got some land. And probably even more land if you wanted to add, add another structure, you know, within reason. But look at that. Three-car garage and space up above it. So that is cool. At least in my opinion. I like it. And then here, we have a good sized deck here. And we'll go in this door. So I'll circle back and lock that front area. So we keep it locked. Pattern room here. See the stonework. It's very nice. Into the kitchen. Big layout on this. And washer and dryer. With a slop sink. So some of them are updated. Stainless steel but up a few steps, and this is where I actually walked out. So we are going to lock it back up. And I doubt many people use the front door, but if you do, you come in, you go right down, you'll see that kitchen, big open space, and lovely fireplace. Good room here. It's really a split level design. You go up a couple steps and you can go down. Hopefully we can get in that garage. I tried the uh, code right away and it didn't necessarily work. So I'll give it a, a little chance. A little step down there. So bedroom number one officially. You got a closet. Looks like a cool little nook here. Got to see what's going on there, right? Oh, wow. Like a cedar closet? Nah, just wood. And the light. Closet here. Access up there. Linen closet. Right there, and it should be a bathroom here, and it is. So there's a the bathroom, good size. Remember, we saw the one bedroom right there. So we'll spin you around and head on up. Definitely a unique house. So one bedroom, we got two, three, four, and then a bathroom. So it looks like four bedrooms. Here's the bathroom down here. This is gonna be called the green room. And look out the back there with a closet in the corner. Let's see what we have behind this one. Oh, cool. Roof, oh, well, there's the roof, but you got access here and a lot of storage. Let's see how they added on to the original house from what I can tell. Closet there. <laughs> Looks like one of these same cool doors here. Oh, this one's nice. And they outline it in plywood. Probably the smallest bedroom in the house, but still adequate. Window in the back. And then this room with two windows and a ceiling fan. That is the super quick rundown. <laughs> so let's see the lower level. Do you like seeing that exposed stone? That's pretty cool. Again, back to the kitchen. See a little bit more of that. Down we go. Get some lights. Ooh, cool. All right. So, just space under there, under the steps, and then the basement. There's carpet in there, walk out, fireplace. Cool, very cool. And then what do we have here? That's a good question. Closet, awesome. <laughs> very cool, a lot of space. And then, <laughs> A little bit more, a little closet, just the way they section it off. All right, that is the rundown. Lights work, probably an area there for storage as well. Turn those lights off, and that's all she wrote for this house. Let's turn those off, leave it as we found it. Big kitchen, reconfigurable too, I would imagine. If somebody wanted to reposition this island, there you are. Big dining area, and remember the powder room as soon as we came in. So that is everything. Let's see if one of these keys magically opens that garage door. That would be fantastic. I wasn't getting very lucky with 
typing in the code. So back outside. That's a cool garage. All right, so it shouldn't be the key we just used. We have two other ones to try. Let's see. Actually, I didn't call this out. You got a patio right here too. An awning off of that would be really cool, in my opinion. Schlage, that's a Schlage key. Not working there, not working there. This looks like a Schlage. All right, we got one open. Do we have the other? And we do! All right. Cool. One, two, three. Let there be light. Wow. Big space. Three car garage. Finish the walls and the ceiling with OSB board. And then what I've been waiting for. Look at these locks, they're serious. Let's head on up. Up here, essentially gonna be an apartment, I would hope, or just storage space. Oh, they had his office space. Look at that. Got a heater, got an AC. <laughs> they don't want you going out there because that takes you to the outside. But you could run across there, I'll show you, and then jump. Four big windows. Cool space. All right, down we go. And that is most of it. Cool. Yeah. Nice structure to have. I'll lock that back up. Oh, by the way, you got a panel here too. Cool. Electric saw here. Appears to be newer too. All right, we're locked. Got a fridge there, and there's a heater behind the fridge too. I think that might be propane. All right, awesome. And just hang with me. Oh, let's go this way too. You do have the AC unit, which I don't want to leave. And you, you go up on an incline here. So that was, I'm sure they cut it out and regraded to give you this shape. There's the AC unit. And the back of it makes it look massive. That's the way they added on. Plenty of parking, I said within township rules and regulations. Probably could even add another structure. So we'll see how much land you have. But, let's lock these up. Nice and easy. Cool. Well, I'll show you where I parked. <laughs> That's fun. But I did, I, I, ran, I went all the way around. So this wraps all the way there. And that's how you get out. That raised berm area is this, you know, gravel road. Plenty of parking. Yeah, I, I get the plot plan and see exactly how much it is. Then when I was upstairs, if you see up there on the top left, that's where that door was barricaded. You put railings and walk out of there. That way people don't actually have to go in the garage per se. They uh, use the upstairs. A cool property. Even some space in that corner. But I will leave you right here. I think that is the shot that shows it the best.